Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Kenley Jensen during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, New Los Angeles Dodgers, AJ Pollock, Center, with President Andrew Friedman, left, and manager Dave Roberts holds up his New Jersey during a press conference during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, the gallery will resume in seconds Los Angeles Dodgers Justin Turner, and Corey Seager during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, former Los Angeles Dodger pitcher Fernando Valenzuela signs autographs during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Angel Rodriguez shows off his artwork on his head during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodger pitcher Joe Kelly speaks to fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, fans pose for pictures on home plate during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, a Justin Turner fan wearing a red beard waits for him to make an appearance during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, a small Dodger dog during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Kenley Jensen shakes hands with fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, New Los Angeles Dodgers, AJ Pollock, right, with President Andrew Friedman, left, tries on his New Jersey during a press conference during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, New Los Angeles Dodgers AJ Pollock, left, speak with President Stan Kasten during a press conference during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers President of Baseball Operations Andrew Friedman during a press conference for AJ Pollock during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, former Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Fernando Valenzuela, second from right, along with Jamie Jaron, right, speak to fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Kenley Jensen speaks to the media during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, former Los Angeles Dodger pitcher Fernando Valenzuela signs autographs during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California.
photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, two-year-old Sofia Sanchez of Los Angeles high-fives the Dodger mascot during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Kenley Jensen shakes hands with fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, fans pose with the Dodger mascot during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Kent Maeda speaks to the media during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, fans pose with the Dodger mascot during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, New Los Angeles Dodgers AJ Pollock during a press conference during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles Dodger pitcher Joe Kelly speaks to fans during Dodger Stadium Fan Fest at Dodger Stadium on Saturday, January 26, 2019 in Los Angeles, California. Photo by Keith Birmingham, Pasadena Star News, SCNG, Los Angeles, for four months last year, it was always on Kenley Jansen's mind. There were multiple visits to a cardiologist, an app on his phone that tracked his heart's daily performance and questions, lots of questions, from reporters and family not to mention constantly swirling around in his head. I'm feeling great, honestly, said Jansen who underwent a five and a half hour surgery on November. 26, the second time in six years that he needed an ablation procedure to address defects in his heart that triggered an irregular heartbeat. I feel like health-wise, I'm in a better spot now. I feel like a weight came off, doing that surgery, Jansen said his doctors have told him that there is only a 5% chance he will have another episode of atrial fibrillation. He is no longer on blood thinning medication, something that he found difficult to play while taking last fall, and threw off a bullpen mount Thursday for the first time since the surgery. And he is not kidding when he says a weight has been lifted off him since the surgery. Jansen said he has lost 20 to 25 pounds this winter thanks to his Kenley Jansen diet, which cut out carbs and sugar, ice cream being the most difficult sacrifice. It was a struggle but I did it, he said at the Dodgers Fan Fest Saturday. It was a struggle, a lot of mood swings, but I did it. I kind of messed up at Christmas and had rice for the first time. But now I'm watching what I eat. All that stuff you put in your body, it's not good for my heart. Let's worry about health first. I don't want to do another surgery so I have to take care of my heart, Dodgers manager Dave Roberts called last year's recurrence of the irregular heartbeat, a big, unfortunate wake-up call, he's in fantastic shape, Roberts said. The heart issue made the second half of last season a struggle for Jansen. But there were problems before that. Light workload in spring training, an attempt to compensate for the heavy burden Jansen had carried in the two previous post-seasons, left him with an injured hamstring and unsettled mechanics for the first couple months of the regular season. Jansen has no intention of making that mistake again. Definitely pitch, Jansen said with a smile of his spring plans this year. No sitting down and taking a vacation and helping you guys, doing media. I'm going to do my job, get myself ready and throw as many innings as I need to get ready for the season, Jansen readily admits, I'm not happy at all about that year that I had last year. He still converted 38 of 42 saves during the regular season. But he let two leads get away during the World Series loss to the Boston Red Sox. His 3.01 era in strikeout rate, 10.3 per 9 innings, during the regular season were career worsts. 
His 0.99 whip was his highest since 2014 and the home runs, oh, the home runs. His cutter, the superpower that has made him one of the best closers in baseball, deserted him at time. Without its movement and traveling with diminished velocity, Jansen gave up 13 home runs, the most by any new National League reliever last season. Jansen believes being in better shape in lock his mechanics in early this spring will bring the movement and velocity back. I'm not going to focus on that, he said of the lost velocity last season. I know you guys will and you guys will let me know about it. Dot dot dot. To me, if you focus on velocity, then you're going to create bad habits. That has to come naturally. In January, you're not going to have velocity. You're going to have no adrenaline. You want to make sure that your mechanics are in place and the velocity comes at the end. If you're going to worry about it now, you're going to create bad habits and it's never going to come. It happened with me last year when in April I wasn't ready. I worried about my velocity and created bad habits. Then trying to get out of those bad habits is not fun. I'm just going to get myself ready and it will come. I know I have it in there. I'm not going to lose it.